हेलो एवरी वन वेलकम बैक ऑन नेक्स्ट मोर चैनल गाइज आई एम रामके सिंह यूनिटी गेम डेवलपर यूट्यूबर एंड ब्लॉगर सो फ्रेंड्स इन टू डे वीडियो जस्ट गोइंग टू इंटीग्रेट स्मार्ट फॉक्स सर्वर टेक्स विद द यूनिटी गोइंग टू बी अ सीरीज इन विच आई विल शेयर मेनी स्टप दैट वेयर वी यूज द स्मार्ट फॉक्स हाउ इज द वे वी कैन इंटीग्रेट द स्मार्ट फॉक्स एंड वॉट आर द मेथड्स वॉट आर द integration process what are the going in the background and which application use the smart fox server we are going to cover in this series this is very useful series why because most of us know about the photon server we know about the mirror but most of us we don't know about the smart fox server but photon server smart fox server mirror every server have their own useful cases so i will share that where and which kind of application use the smart fox server and which kind of application use the photon server and uh, most of you are requesting me to make the tutorial in hindi language but i want to say sorry for it you have to improve your english because if i am going to provide you a material in hindi so there is a many disadvantage like first disadvantage for me that i will have a little amount of the audience second thing that if you are not going to improve your english so that will be a disadvantage for you you will be not able to work with the your uh, uk us based clients you will not able to explore or new technologies new like uh, metaverse vr most of the tutorials are coming in the english language so that will be a disadvantage for you so i am requesting to you that please improve your please improve your english my english is really not so good so i will try, so i try to improve my english and provide you provide you my content in english language so please humble request try to listen english audio books videos watch english videos and that will help you to improve your english box and uh, i will try to reply you and uh, just hit the like button that will help us to reach me to most of people who need this tutorial here is the website of smart fox server the overview you can just go through that where we can use and what is the smart fox server so basically it is a server so it works front end and back end both and most of people ask me that why we need back end basically if you are not using the back end smart fox server will not work in unity if you want to work with without the server so you can work with the photon but without the server our photon will be a limited because basically they provide the networking and uh, they provide the little bit a data transmission but if you want to more data transmission as well as if you up open your application you want to see your data your scores so your boards that uh, which player have what the score so you need a server so that in the future when you reopen your application you able to see the current update so this is why you need a server so first of all you have to explore the smart fox server and currently i will show you a front end work with the smart fox because i don't have a server so i really don't have knowledge about the smart fox back end server because it works on the java java developer if you want to create a back end of smart fox server but i will show you everything which work in the front end because i work in the i work on many application that use the smart fox server and most of the were most of were the casino games so i have full idea about the front end and uh, no idea i just only know that back end use the java so you need uh, to write your code for back end in java and uh, for unity in c sharp so just go through it once and here is the unity c sharp example so when you go here so you you will be able to download uh, sfx examples and you will get to know that uh, which kind of 
means they have provide a full example that where you can learn that how you can create connection and what are the methods but uh, not they have provide uh, basically and you have you can get a little bit uh, understanding problem to them so i will explain everything and i have few script that i will share with you as well as i will explain that how it works with the custom because most of things they have provide the the connection and i will explain that uh, what the drawbacks what the usefulness we get when use the smart fox let me explain that which kind of application we can make using the smart fox server one pdf so here is my pdf so basically by using the smart fox you can make casino type of game like roulette or there are many kind of uh, many kind of application you can make in the roulette like single wheel double wheel triple wheel jkq jkqa as well as casino games which involves the real money and uh, here is you can make card games any kind of card games can be make using the smart fox server so i am saying you everything on the basis of my experience i have worked on many roulettes as well as all these games as well as all the card games can be make using the smart fox and we can't make using the using the uh, smart fox server we can't make that fps kind of game or we can make but that will be a too much difficult for us so we avoid like fps where we use the mostly photon because photon provide the animation sync on the network so that will help us a lot and in photon by syncing your animation on the network it create a really problem for us make a casino type of or card guys type of games so you have to consider this this server that is called smart fox server okay great here i have explored the sfs unity examples and here is the connector lobby body masses trees object movement first person shooter so these are the examples these are the examples and if you want to integrate with the unity project so let's suppose i have one project i have taken that is the sfs and you want to integrate the sfs in this project so basically they don't provide the package they provide the dll file so how you can get the dll file so if you have this so what you have to do is just go in the their examples and here so you have to go in the asset and you can open any example scene and there you will get plugins so in plugin you will get this so what you have to do is just copy the plugin so just copy and open the unity project so light had gone so let's continue our work so just so in explorer and go in asset and just paste here so basically it is a dll and when you paste here so it will just take a little time to load it now you can see you have plugins and here is a smart fox so basically here you can allow that uh, what for which platform you want to perform so the next tutorial i will share you that how connection work in smart fox so if you love the video so don't forget to like subscribe and share and see you in next part so thanks for watching have a good day